Hello everybody, welcome back to the Disney Parks Now. Today we will be making a miniature version of Phantasmic, which if you haven't heard of it, which I'm pretty sure you have, it's basically a show at Disney's Hollywood Studios where Mickey does all these crazy sorcery things and he makes the water rise and then I'm not gonna spoil it for you because some of you probably are, um, are, you know, either haven't seen it or are maybe going to a trip someday. And I just don't want to spoil it. Cause, um, but if you want to see it, it's on YouTube. You just search up Phantasmic Disney's Hollywood Studios and it'll be there. First, um, what you'll need for this is some clay, hot glue, um, and some wax paper. Now, first, you're just gonna wanna make a base out of hot glue. Um, kinda just finishing mine up. It, um, you really wanna let it dry for a while um, cause you will be taking this off the parchment paper. Next, you're gonna want, this is going to be like, he makes the water levels rise in the show, so I'm gonna make some little towers of hot glue. But I'm just gonna kind of start off them because you want that to dry so you can add on to them later. So some little dots of hot glue. And while we're waiting for that to dry, so we can add on to it, it does hot glue never takes too long to dry. Um, I'm going to be picking out the color I kind of am thinking we should do this color for the rock. Um, I am going to be painting it a little bit in a little in, in a second um, after we finish the main base and I'm getting that color to play out of there. And for the clay, you really want to start off with kind of a weird oval shape. Um, just kind of because it is kind of its own little island and you do want it to, you know, look like it is there. So, um, this. And perfect. Just kind of want to. Actually, what we could do is hot glue it. This clay, I'm not sure how you make it dry. I'm not sure if it's air dry. I'm not sure if it, if you need to cook it. And you kind of want to make it just a little bit ahead of the edge of the base. Now we're gonna add a little bit more to those towers of hot glue. We aren't gonna make them too tall, but we do want them to be there because he does, that is a big part of the show, the water effects. Make sure you do have a lot of hot glue sticks for this. It does take a lot of hot glue sticks, at least five or six. Okay, so now that we kind of got those on their second level, for the next part of the rock, um, make kind of a smaller version of what we just did. Um, but it can be a little bit different. Doesn't need to be, doesn't need to go on to both those sides. It just kind of needs to be in the middle. There. Since we already put the clay down, we can just put it on top of that. Next, we're gonna make the main rock formation. So you just need to get a piece of clay, kind of round it out a little bit. And also we're gonna kind of make sure this is kind of flat because we are gonna be putting a Mickey Mouse figure there later. Um, you don't have to put one there, it is optional. And if you don't have one, you can just make one out of clay. So we're gonna, and actually while we're doing that, because you can pretty much do that with one hand. Just to add a little bit of our next layer to the little towers of hot glue. And 
now that we've got those next little tower things of water kind of let's uh, finish this little rock formation um, and then we will add detail with paint Right now you're kind of seeing the like view from above, but right now it kind of looks like the Lion King, sort of. But it won't look like that in a little bit because we have to finish it still. Next, we'll make a smaller version of that just to go over here. Ooh, burn myself with hot glue. Okay, so you're going to want to do that smaller version to go right there. And we aren't going to really be building the stadium that you watch this in because it's huge and I don't want to have to do all that. But we will be doing some other things you can make for this. Now we're going to just kind of finish these. They don't have to be very high towers. I want the t two towers in the front. It should be a little bit taller though because... It... Let it kind of set before we finish it. And while we're waiting, let's um, we'll see if I have any more clay. And I do. I do have some white clay that we can use to make a riverboat. Um, also, you're also going to need a darker color clay for the interior of the boat. They aren't really going to build most of the interior, so what you really need is build a larger, uh, a smaller oval first, or you can do the larger oval. We got an oval. Um, we're going to build a larger oval. And then this is optional this little side project gonna add that to it add the next layer and now the little smoke stacks at the top so you're just gonna make two little cylinders more squared ish though and then we can just cut that one in half. And then you have a, actually we'll just do, we'll just do one. Or let's do two. Here, let's cut that one in half. I'm sorry, I'm taking a little bit on this step. But yeah, you just need to. Well, this is kind of supposed to look like Steamboat Willie because it is supposed to be Steamboat Willie in the show, but it doesn't look exactly like it. So there you go for a little Steamboat to go with it. It does fit in the front of it, but, you know, with the water towers, it doesn't. So now we're going to finish the... I don't want the hot glue towers. You don't have to make them too big. I'm not the best with hot glue, so I'm just going to kind of stop right there. But I do want some larger water towers. So, when in doubt, use clay. I'm just going to be using some bright colors of clay. We're going to make some little water tower things. So, first we're going to make a red one. Just roll a little cylinder. Get this. Thin as possible. 
there. We've got one of the water jets. Now, it's, it would be really hard to connect it just with the power of the clay to the base. So we're gonna use hot glue, because hot glue is amazing. Whoever invented hot glue is a genius. Now we're gonna do blue. do it right next to it. Now I'm going to do orange or yellow, depending on whatever you like. Any colors, really. Actually, I kind of like yellow better with that. With these, really pick and choose what colors you like best out of your clay. Sorry, my clay is in, is there's a lot of plastic around it in the packaging it came in. Kind of came in these like plastic envelopes, so it's like hard to just keep doing that. And continue it on both sides. Got that one. Got the red and the blue. Now we've basically got the majority of it done. So now just really peel it off the wax paper, which might be a challenge. Um, as you can see, um, I still have a lot of the wax paper on. Um, some of the hot glue might still just be a little bit warm, but you don't really see the wax paper underneath it. It just looks like water. So you really, if there's still wax paper underneath it, it should still look like water. Now, if you want to, you can go under and rip it out. See, it does kind of stick to it, though, so... Be careful. Um, also, um, you want to cook the clay, like make, build this on its own if the clay is cooking, cookable, because like if you need to cook it because the, you don't want to cook hot glue because bad stuff will happen in your oven. Um, just make sure if you need to cook it, cook it before you glue it. Um, now I'm going to bring you to the studio so we can finish Now it. that we are back in the studio, it's time to see um, what it looks like with a Mickey Mouse figure on it. That looks amazing. That just looks amazing. Now, if you don't have a Mickey Mouse figure like this, or if yours is too big, um, you can totally make one out of clay. Might even make a whole separate video just on how to make um, Mickey Mouse out of clay. But it totally looks like the real thing. Um, lot, you know, Mickey would be way smaller on the real thing. Um, the real thing is he's way smaller for scale. But if you look at the online website, Fantasmic, like it ha it's, has Mickey, it has the water jets. It looks, it just looks just like this. Um... So I, I, I think this is, you know, you might even want to, if you want to, you can make, you can, you can make the rock formations a little bit bigger, but honestly, I think it looks good, you know, nice display, you know, if you don't want to have Mickey on there, you don't have to, but I think it looks great. If you like this video, please sure, um, you know, subscribe, like, um, comment and you know how's your how yours turned out because uh, i want to know if it you know works for you guys um and have a great day